kinds of angles. Remember this name, Val Sokoroa. This is an acronym for vertical angles, adjacent angles, linear pair, supplementary angles, complementary angles, right angle, obtuse angle, acute angle. An angle is formed by two non-collinear rays that have a common endpoint. The endpoint is the vertex and each ray is the side of the angle. This symbol represents an angle. The vertex is point A. The sides are ray AC and ray AB. And it can be named as angle 1, angle A, angle CAB, and angle BAC. Two angles are congruent if they have the same measure. If angle DOG is congruent to angle CAT, then the measure of angle DOG is equal to the measure of angle CAT. A point is in the interior of an angle if it does not lie on the angle itself and it lies on a segment whose end points are on the sides of the angle. Point K is in the interior of angle BAC. An angle bisector is a line or ray that divides an angle into two congruent angles. Ray AD bisects angle CAB. If D is in the interior of angle CAB and angle CAD, is congruent to angle BAT. Ray AD is the bisector of angle CAB. An acute angle is an angle whose measure is less than 90 degrees. Example. The measure of angle YES equals 30 degrees. A right angle is an angle whose measure is equal to 90 degrees. The blue square represents a 90 degree angle. The measure of angle YES is equal to 90 degrees. An obtuse angle is an angle whose measure is more than 90 degrees. Example, the measure of angle YES is equal to 160 degrees. Adjacent angles are two angles that have a common vertex and a common side. Point E is the common vertex and ray ET is the common side. Angle BET and angle SET are adjacent angles. Vertical angles are non-adjacent angles formed by two intersecting lines. Angle HAE and angle RAT are vertical angles. Angle HAR and angle EAT are vertical angles. Vertical angles are congruent, meaning angle HAE is congruent to angle RAT and angle HAR is congruent to angle EAT. Supplementary angles are two angles whose sum is 180 degrees. The measure of angle 1 plus the measure of angle 2 
equals 180 degrees. Supplementary angles do not have to be adjacent. Examples of supplementary angles are 165 degrees and 15 degrees. Note that it sums up to 180 degrees. Another example is 110 degrees and 70 degrees. 110 plus 70 is equal to 180 degrees. Each angle is called a supplement of the other. Complementary angles are two angles whose sum is 90 degrees. The measure of angle 1 plus the measure of angle 2 equals 90 degrees. Complementary angles do not have to be adjacent. Angle 1 and angle 2 are complementary angles. 60 degrees plus 30 degrees equals 90 degrees. 20 degrees plus 70 degrees equals 90 degrees. Each angle is called a complement of the other. A linear pair is two angles that are adjacent and supplementary. Angle 1 and angle 2 form a linear pair. Name a point in the interior of angle DHF. Name two angles that have C as vertex. Name two angles that have HJ as a side. Name a pair of acute vertical angles. Name a pair of obtuse vertical angles. Which angle forms a linear pair with angle EBF? Which angle is supplementary to angle EBA? Which angle is complementary to angle EBA? If the measure of angle ABD equals 15x minus 21 and the measure of angle EBC equals 12x plus 6. Find x and the measure of angle EBC. Angle ABD and angle EBC are vertical angles. Vertical angles are congruent, meaning the measure of angle ABD equals the measure of angle EBC. 15x minus 21 equals 12x plus 6. 3x equals 27. x equals 9. The measure of angle EBC equals 12 times 9 plus 6. This is equal to 108 plus 6. And the measure of angle EBC is equal to 114 degrees.